it takes hunger to be fed. Until a man is hungry, he will never go for food. So any area of life where you want to see results, you must be hungry for result in that area. Some people are so complacent with life. They are okay with their littleness. No, you must have a vision and passion for a better life. Life can be better than what it is around you. And when you desire for your story to change, that is what will keep you awake late in the night to begin to reason your way out, to begin to calculate your way out, to begin to think and begin to imagine. That is what will keep you on your toes to begin to pray. That is what will keep you on your knees asking God there is a way out. What must I do? Am I communicating? So sometimes we ask and receive not because we ask and miss. Praying the wrong, you can be praying and be praying wrong. And looks as if God is not God. God is always God. You need to ask the right question to get the right answer. So you say, ask and you shall receive. Seek and you shall find. Knock and it shall be opened. Whosoever asketh, receive it. But the problem is that a lot of us are asking wrongly and we are receiving wrong answers. Some of you, they pray, you need to start praying. It's, oh Lord, direction. Oh Lord, wisdom. Oh Lord, idea. Open my eyes to see. Open my ears to hear. Open my heart to know the path to go in life. Am I communicate? That is the right prayer. Oh Lord, bless me. Bless you with what? Oh Lord, prosper me. What will he prosper? When he wants to bless you, he will bless you through the works of your hand. If you have no works of hand, you are not a candidate of the blessing. 